Hi everyone, it's Sarah with Children's Ministry and this is your preschool video for Sunday, January 28th. Thank you so much for serving. We could not do this without you. God is good and we are all part of his family. Well, this Sunday we are focusing on Jesus and Nicodemus and our lesson is taken from John 3, 1 through 21. And the basics are Nicodemus was a religious leader who came to Jesus at night. Jesus told Nicodemus he must be born again. Nicodemus didn't understand what Jesus meant, so Jesus explained it to him using word pictures. Natural versus spiritual birth. The spirit is like wind that blows wherever it pleases and Moses and the serpent. And Jesus told him that anyone who believes in the Son of God would have eternal life. Our no God is God gave us his son so that he so that we could live forever. And our show God is I should believe that Jesus is the Son of God. And our verse of the month is still John 3.16. So here's a look at the coloring sheet. And keep handing out the newsletters. It's the last week for that. And when we go outside, we'll be doing stacking cups. And when we come in, we'll have our last week of these worship songs, which you can listen to on Maranatha Chapel Kids YouTube channel. And our lesson is going to be a human puppet show. We've done this one before. It's pretty fun. And what is Squirmy up to? He is going to explain to Sir Quackers what it means to be born again. And this is a look at her craft. It's pretty simple. It's this little secret meeting box. Um, and if you look inside, it shows how Jesus and Nicodemus had a meeting at night. And it has our verse in it as well. And we've already pre-folded it for you. So really, all the kids are going to do is just tape, tape this little box together. And that's it. And if you want to let them, they could color the outside first if they wanted to, and then you can pre, or then you can tape it with them. And we don't actually have the Jesus Storybook Bible or the Beginner's Bible that has this lesson in it. So we have these little booklets that you can use to retell the story in your class. You can also use the memory verse posters. And I know that a lot of the kids have already memorized the verse, so that is awesome. So mark your calendars. Don't forget on February 25th at 1230 in the Fellowship Hall, we are going to have our Children's Ministry 2024 kickoff meeting and we will be providing lunch for you. So reach out to me with any questions. I pray that you all are having an amazing week in Christ. Thank you. Bye.